Fantastic Gaming The channel where Logan will show you everything From gameplay to gear, their crew is here To take you on a journey through every atmosphere Releases to news, you don't have to choose Red Fantastic Gaming is here for you Hey everybody, before we get started, ignore this so I know it's going to be through the whole thing. I spilled some coffee. That's it. So ignore that. Um, it, it's, yeah. Ignore it. So, <laughs> okay. This is an awesome, awesome, awesome video in my opinion for something that, well, if you guys like Game Boys and you like modded or custom, you know, this is an awesome video. And I'm going to start out by... This is the guy who made it, who made both of them. I'm showing you two. So I'm going to put those throughout. He's awesome. Really cool guy. Met him uh, at uh, a store called, well, East Starland, the actual retail store. And first thing I saw was Game Boys. He had custom Game Boys. There was one that I wanted to get. It was all white. I was like, oh, I want this that I was looking at. I was like, oh, it's really cool. So I was like, Ho hold on. Let me go ask my my wife because any, any smart man and uh, all you guys that are either engaged or married or, well, you you know, you ask your wife for permission. And I don't care what anybody says. It's a smart thing to do. So I went and asked her. Came back. The guy behind me bought it. I was like, oh, but he did have this. They're like, that's just a Game Boy Pocket. Game Boy Pocket, say, what? Now, it looks like a regular one. It smells like a regular one. Smell, see, smell it. Okay, stop. Um, and it feels like a regular one. But, I'm gonna show you a little something. Oh, wait. What's the, what the heck? Are these, but, the same size. Same look, same smell, same taste. No, we're not tasting them. Um, but yeah, you see the screen's a little bigger here, but this is custom. And I'm gonna show you what. Got a little game. You guys all know this game. Now this one, he gave me, and I'll tell you in a moment. He gave me two games. Mario Land 2 with this one and Tetris with the other one. But, Oh, oh, no, how to ruin a video. Let's see, come on. Okay, the batteries just stay alive long enough. Look how gorgeous that screen is. I mean, this is a Game Boy Pocket and you can play. How beautiful is that screen? On the flight back from DC, I was playing Mario Land 2 on this. I had my Switch with me. I had bought a ton of games up there, like four or five Switch games on top of that. And this is what I was playing Mario Land 2 on this. And look at how gorgeous that screen is. And yeah, beautiful. So awesome. I thought it was great. It wasn't the white original uh, Game Boy model, but I fell in love with this one and I was like, man, this thing is fantastic. And so he made this one. That was my original one. Now, one thing I'm gonna show you, I'm sure you guys are all familiar with this sucker. This is my original. This is my original Game Boy. It's horrendous. There's no batteries in it, so I'm not gonna turn it on. It's old, it's older than some of you guys watching this. But as you can see, it's it's been through hell and back. I've played this for many years. This is, again, my original. I Pokemon stickers on it in, what, 98, 99, whenever Pokemon came out. I was 15, 16, something like that, and I was, I was really obsessed with Pokemon at the time. But everybody was. So that's the original. So I'm going to leave that there. When I got back... Um, from DC 
uh, he, he gave me his card and I contacted him. He's got an Etsy shop. But, like, again, you can check him out here. And we started talking and he's like, I'll make you one. What? I'll make you one. So I wanted the all white one. And guess what came in? Oh, look at that gorgeous. Oh, let me get that fingerprint off the screen. <laughs> look at that. Yeah, you see the screen's a little blue, right? But look, you've got the all white buttons. I wanted white on white. He asked me what screen I wanted with it, the, the boundary. I was like, white. I want all white on white. Look at that sucker. Now, one thing I'm going to show you, he added a, a little nifty trick to it. Now, it's, it is a different shelf. From my understanding, it is a, an original uh, innards of an original Game Boy. A couple modifications. So, let's pop in. This, he sent this Tetris with this. How awesome is that to get Tetris with it? I opened it up and boom. And I talk about it. I was impressed how he shipped this. I mean, everything was mm, gorgeous. And here we go. And it still has the... Look at that. You can still adjust it depending on your leggings. Whoa! How gorgeous is that? I mean, this is just fantastic. This is awesome. You don't get that murky green screen. You get the blue light, and but it's still an original. And okay, I'm gonna show you a little trick. Let's see. All right, so we pop out the battery. Whoops, we pop out this battery. And in there, he has a little switch. So the switch allows you to um, flip it and change the contrast so what would be black would be white and what would be white would be black but also if I'm not mistaken you flip I think you flip this one still blue now it took me a little bit to figure out because I didn't want to say hey what do I have to do so that flip that there we go you got your green screen back so that green screen how cool how freaking cool is that now if you flip the other switches it actually does the the inverse so it makes the white black and the, the black white so you get that screen again you got those colors. How awesome is this? So I was I was happy as a pig in shit uh, to get this, and he does some fantastic work, and um, yeah, yeah. So hit him up, contact him. You see it all throughout the video. And one other awesome, awesome thing he does. He always gives freebies with uh, with his consoles, and one thing. I, I, I was not inspecting, uh, inspecting, sorry, expecting for when I opened up the, the mailbox, the, um, the envelope was actually pretty big. It was like two pieces. I was like, wait, what? And I opened it up and in another little box, he has CIB because I don't speak Japanese. A CIB bonus. He He wrote that. Because he doesn't speak Japanese. Boom! <laughs> Dragon Quest Monsters. Game Boy Color. Complete. And j just as a freebie. I mean, fantastic. I don't speak Japanese either, but who cares? This thing is awesome. Look at this. In the box and everything. I was ecstatic. I was tickled freaking pink. And man. Awesome. Just, just simply awesome. I mean... Yeah, uh, fantastic work. I mean, amazing craftsmanship. And I will be playing this quite a bit. I'm going to go back and play a number of my old Game Boy games on here. This is what I wanted. And next, I've already talked to him. 
He's going to make a Game Boy Advance for me. The original Game Boy Advance, the long one, you know, the original one with a light uh, backlit screen. And yeah, so that'll be in the work soon. As soon as that comes in, hit you with another video, show it to you, check him out. That's Gooseworks, handmade custom shop at Gooseworks Shop. Uh, he has a shop on Etsy. Uh, he's also on Instagram. Uh, check him out there. And thank you, man, so much. He's awesome, awesome, awesome. And great pricing. So, you know, awesome. So, if you guys like this, make sure you hit the thumbs up. Go check him out. Uh, like the video. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Head on over to redbandanagaming.com. Our social medias, Facebook and Instagram, Red Band, at Red Bandana Gaming, Twitter at RBG underscore Retro. Again, hit the little thingy down there and subscribe. Thank you guys so much. And like we always say, be like, be like Gooseworks. Be like his work. Be legendary. Thanks again. So cool.